More than a century ago, some of the greatest scientific minds in the world believed in spiritualism, the ability to communicate with the dead. Science is no longer open-minded about seances and psychic mediums, but the traditions continue to thrive, at least in some circles. George Knapp of Mystery Wire has more. An exhibition of striking photos now on display at the University of Maryland documents a 20-year research project that explores the intersection of spiritualism and photography. Writer and photographer Shannon Taggart took a deep dive into the world of spiritualism by immersing herself in the practices of seances and spirit communication at one of the best-known enclaves of spiritualism. Taggart has tried it herself with mixed results. Her photos show, among other things, a weird substance known as ectoplasm that pops up from time to time in photographs taken during seances. The images of ectoplasm are really very absurd and very um, shockingly strange. I mean, some of the strangest images I think I've ever encountered in the history of photography are the early ectoplasm images. I mean, some of them are very like the mediums will be half naked with these these gooey like things popping out all over and ectoplasm is a symbol of life and death meeting and some some spirituals believe the ectoplasm in those pictures is absolutely real others believe it was faked for the camera, but it's still a real substance. The spiritualists believe death is a mere transition, not the end. Do Taggart's photos amount to proof of an afterlife? The seance photos, communicating with the dead. The story on mysterywire.com. George Knapp reporting. Now let's take a live look courtesy of the Sky Tracker Network at the Seawall Cam in Galveston. We're CW 39 Houston.